if you are thinking of joining us from September, October, you might be thinking, well, what can I do over the, the long and hopefully glorious British summer that we're about to have? What can I do to kind of get up to speed on criminology? Where can I learn more about crime? Because that's obviously the thing that you're really interested in if you want to come and study criminology with us. And there's a lot of stuff that you can do. So some of it is easier. Some of it's a bit more stimulating, if you will. Uh, things you can do is very simple. Watch the news. Keep an eye out for crime related stories. Watch some crime related programs or you can do a bit of research as well. So on here we have links to the Office for National Statistics. They put out really regular information about crime rates, who's being victimised, where crimes are happening, all that kind of stuff, which can be really interesting and start to see patterns and trends in crime. As well, there is the police crime map, which I'm going to be honest, hours of fun. You can, look at, uh, you can look at your local area or a place where you're thinking of moving to or maybe where you've lived before or just anywhere you're interested in and see crime trends for that area, what kind of types of crimes have happened and it breaks it down into like really quite detailed, granular detail. So you can get a lot of, lot of information from that and it's really interesting to see and compare different areas, what types of crimes are happening where, how much are they happening and that kind of stuff as well. There is the School of Criminology research pages. Now, we're not just a teaching institution. We do carry out a lot of research as well. A lot of the people who will be teaching you are also researchers. And you can see on here current active current projects or links to past work that has been published by the academics here. We do have the Centre for Hate Crime Studies, which is a very well renowned research centre, which does a lot of work about hate crime, how we can prevent this, how we can support people who've been victimised by it. So that's really, really interesting if you're, you know, thinking about having something to have a read of.